All right, what up, people? Um, your boy here. I was going to get some audio recording off the television, but it's acting funny right now, so it's not letting me do the audio recording. But I think the mic is good enough to use. Uh, right now, I just want to give you a review on a couple of items that I got from um, that I got from Amazon. Um, and this is the new way I wanted to do the U in reviews. Only reason why I'm doing it this way is because the other way, let's just say that, um, it, it uses a lot of data. And I mean, an awful lot of data. So, the first thing I want to review is the, I can't pronounce that, but it's the Twister Arm Exerciser. It can go anywhere adjustable from 22 pounds up to... 440 pounds let me see if i can adjust this window here so you can kind of see a little bit more of it uh doo -doo -doo. okay yep so it's 38.99 i think i got it when it was on sale anyways you could used to be able to get it in three colors which was the black color and the red color for some odd reason they're out of the blue color which is the one I actually got. I actually got the blue color one. And um, I do, this is supposed to work out the chest. So when I use it myself, I can feel it working out right underneath the pectoral muscle and on the side. Um, I can actually feel it in the lats as well. I can even feel it in my shoulders a little bit in the triceps as well. Um, I don't know specifically what every single muscle is called, but... It, it's it's awesome now you got this little stick right here basically what it does is it hooks in here and it kind of holds this together so it can be easily portable you know what i'm saying and i usually put it in a bag with the other exercise equipment which i'm also show you as well okay so let's look at some of these pictures real quick okay so it shows that you can use it from let me go up a little bit you can use it this way you can use it this way um you can turn it upside down and use it as well uh they're over exaggerating with the do the core and then you can also do that that's how you work the lats and stuff like that in the shoulders you can also use it from behind too and it's actually very effective i didn't think it would be as effective as first um so it does have use a liquid backflow and hydraulic rod to keep uh you know what i'm saying the micro rebound say goodbye to danger um it does have an adjusted intensity which when i first used this putting it on number two was difficult wow like it this thing is no joke because of it using a pump action um um rod here in order to kind of get that going they say it's thick carbon steel it does feel strong it feels heavy this thing right here probably weighs about 20 25 pounds just just picking this up alone um let's go ahead and go through here you got this closed cylinder design you got the micro rebound it says it refused to take parent profiteering rebound completely solved the safety hazard for safe use so this one i think is like the fourth model one they got of this let's go down here and see here you can adjust the power. You can basically twist this to adjust the power on there. Um, it's a strong and sturdy material, they say. Uh, let's keep going here. i seen this as well. That's supposed to work out the uh, this uh, forearm right here. Uh, let's see what else do they have. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Trying to see. So this is what I, the era is trying to get to. So basically what they're saying is this is the fourth generation. Okay. So what you want to do is if once you put this on, you want to squeeze right here. And you can take that off. Now there's different ways to use this. You can sit down. I think I got on setting number two. And you can kind of push it together. And it kind of works that out. Like I said, I'm used to setting number two because I use it a lot. And you can basically when if you basically the way I use like to do it is have the back straight, kind of poke the chest out, and really just focus on getting that area to squeeze. Like when you come together, you want to squeeze the pectoral muscles, and you can feel it in here too on the, the uh, triceps. I usually feel it in my shoulders as well. Um, you can go underhand like this, 
which doing the same thing works out. You can feel it in the bicep a little bit when you go ahead and put this together and work out with it. Um, it also, you can actually feel it in your lats too. Another thing I like to do is I like to put it behind me and do the same thing, just squeeze, just solely squeeze. And what I do is while I'm using this, I make sure I'm using targeted muscle movements. So you don't want to just hurry up and just be all like this. You want to make sure you got your form and structure straight. You want to make sure you keep that form straight. And it, it makes it a very effective exercise equipment to use. So that's part of my three-way full at-home gym type of thing. So next up is, let's go to the next one, is this bad boy right here, the Infra Resistant Bands. Not going to lie to you, I love these things, okay? The, this is it right here. It got its own bag. Which, with this bag, I can actually fit not only the resistance bands, but this inside there as well. Um, just in one, you know, carry bag. Um, take this out right here. So, the resistant bar breaks down. And basically, you can... It's these locks right here, which, I'm going to be honest with you, I don't see them as being very durable. That's the... Because, look, this one's bending already. This one's bending already. Yeah, this one... This one's kind of bending there already. So, um, that that part's not really durable. I'm not even going to sit here in front street. Um, let's go ahead and put this bar together because it has potential, but they just need a fix on that bar, man. They definitely, but basically the bars goes together like this. You can see where it's bending right now because I don't use it a lot personally. Um, if you got to, you can actually rotate the bar and spin this around and use it in a different manner if you have to. Um, it has five, no, four, my bad, four different resistance bands on each side. Now, when I first thought about this, there's most that give you one resistant band total. This one gives you one on each side. So you have the, let me see here. This one, I think, is the 40-pound. So the black one is the 40-pound. The green one is the 30-pound. The blue one is the 20-pound. And the red one is the 50-pound of resistance. This thing actually works. You can actually use it to do actual squat. You can do lots of exercises. You can do front arm raises with them. You can do squats. You can do... Um, put it on a door and work out the lat tismus dorsi. You can do a lot of stuff with this. You can do shoulder press exercises with this if you got to. You can do a whole bunch of exercise with this thing um, right here. Um, if if you want to, like what me and my uh, lady was doing, is that we both have it to where we can both use this at the same time to exercise. So one of us may be like holding it. And other one may be sitting in a chair. Like, I can stand behind her while she sits in a chair and, and kind of do the chest exercises while I'm behind her actually holding the bar myself. So as I'm holding the bar, I'm getting a workout from just holding the bar alone as she go ahead and do her, you know, chest exercises. Um, here's right here is where it's showing where you can do the raises, okay, um, by hooking your feet in here. And then actually, I don't know if you can see that or not, but probably got the screen in the way. Sorry about that. But you can actually use it to, let me see if I can, but yeah. And then what she's doing is she's also doing uh, lunges. So you can do lunges with these as well. Um, it has a workout guide here, but the workout, I ain't pay attention to the workout guide. I just do that. It really don't show too many exercises on that workout guide, but here's the multiple uses. Okay, now you can see it. So you can do, you know, shoulder presses or front arm raises, different exercise, biceps, uh, which is my favorite exercise to do on here. You can do squats with it. Now, I will say this, though. To get the best workout from squats, you might have to pull this lever. Because, see, this lever right here lets you extend the range so all you gotta do is pull that back right there and you can extend the range of it or to make it closer you can actually pull that fella all the way up and make it harder for you so the closer which y'all know how resistance bands work the closer 
the range you have to work with, the harder it is of a workout it's going to be on you, okay? Um, these right here, you can do those. Now, when it shows these different type episodes, it's showing the uh, piece that you can actually hook up in between the door, which is this piece right here. You place that in the door, you close the door, and you're able to do a lot more exercises with it. So as long as you're in an area, a wide area, where you can be able to hook onto like a bathroom door or a bedroom door, most bedroom doors are not in the middle. Like my son, his bedroom door is in the middle, but um, most of them are not, you know, like like that. So squats here, you got squats there, lunges. Um, you can get a single resistance band if you want to, and do the pull away exercise. I forgot what the exercise is called. Like I said, I'm not an expert on the names of the exercises. It's been a long time since I even been in the gym and stuff like that. Okay, so. Right here, now, I, I don't know why they do these comparisons. We're just going to look at this one side. You got eight bands, okay? It says it's natural latex, which it seems like it's strong latex. Now, it says high-density quality foam, which the foam layer, it feels good. It, it really actually does feel good. Um, when you go down here and look at the multi-function, can be used as ankle straps and handles. That is true. I'm able to do leg exercises to work the front quadriceps um, with that. But I got a better machine to work the quadriceps that I'm about to show you next. Like I said, I got like a full mini gym here. And this one costs $53.98. Now the other one that I have, I can't even find, bro. Like I gotta find it somewhere. So let's go down here, okay, and you, you get these amazing exercises that you get to see here. Um, what's this one over here? Stretch training and stuff like that. The squat one is not really effective. I think having actual weight to do squats with is way much better. Um, but other than that, it's... Uh, that is true. It's not for short people. So I will say that, uh, let's see here, quality bar, quality bar, not good for short people. So they're right on that. It's not really good for short people. Um, let me go ahead and look up the final product I want to show y'all, which is, it's under the Sunny Health and Fitness brand. So I'm going to put in Sunny Stepper Machine and see if we can find it. Uh, let's see. Ah, this is actually it, but it did not cost that much. Okay, let's see if we can find the one that I actually have here. The one I have has a digital pack. This is actually it, but when I got it, it was on sale for like, like $29 or something like that. So this one, you can actually save an extra $15.58 when you apply the coupon. So they got a lot of good stuff on Amazon. Well, that one's similar to it. But it's basically, let me see here. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Boom. This is the one I had. Um, it was way, yeah, that's the one I have. It was way cheaper than this, though. I got it for like 20. No, wait. No, I think I got it for 50 some bucks. Yeah, I think I got it for, I'm tripping. So all together, and this is it right here, okay? This is the stepper machine. Basically, you know how the stepper machine works. It got a little digital count right here, which can count calories, steps, and the time it takes for you to do uh, the exercises themselves, okay? Um, what I do like about these, it got the resistance bands here, so you can do the pull exercise or what I like to do sometimes when I step on here is do you know wide arm raises um it works on a machine right here which as you step when it this turns and you have these um pressers right here which they said before first use is good to actually have these things oiled up because I've heard a lot of people say that when they do heavy use with it, it did end up getting damaged. So I will warn you about that. But otherwise, for the price itself, I like using this. This is very effective in working the front quad. So it's very effective in working quads. Very, very effective. I'm trying to see if there's a reverse way I can use this to work out the back of my legs. 
in my glutes. But right now, it's good for what it does. Um, so I'm going to try to experiment with that. I'm not going to hold that up too much longer, though. Um, but yeah, they said they got like six videos. So you get the... Mines don't show the sunny on there. Um, so you get the digital monitor, what I was talking about, counts, does the count, the time and the calories, the reps per minute, um, the foot pedals, um, you get the uh, adjustable height dial, and you also get the hydraulic cylinders that I was talking about. And you get the resistant bands. These resistance bands are like 10 resistance. But as you exercise and working out, and depending on your level of exercise, them things can just, man, they, they actually they actually do work pretty good. Um, but yeah, I, I would say that you can all together get this for anywhere from $150 to $115 on Amazon. It is like having a full workout at home. So if you can't get to the gym, um, this will be another way of basically spending $150 to get a full gym workout. And it's portable too. Like it's easy to carry with you. Like I can break this bar down, press in between here the tabs, break that down, okay? And then wrap this up and then fit it in my bag as well with the uh, this and carry that around with me. And then if I want to bring the footstool, the foot uh, with me, I can. Or I can just go jogging or something like that. But I, if I want to, I can bring this with me as well. It doesn't weigh that much. It doesn't weigh that much. It weighs probably about like 30, 30 pounds, 25, 30 pounds. Um, the other equipment doesn't really weigh that much. The bar weighs almost nothing. So that's another 30 pounds right there. So you can around 60 pounds of equipment if you want to just... Go to where you want to go, and you're still getting that full gym workout experience. Um, now, remember, these are resistance bands, so they're not the same as using free weights, because free weights, you have that constant, depending on how you work out, that constant resistance when you work out with uh, free weights. This is not the same as those, but it can be just as effective as using um, the free weights and stuff like that. So I love it. I'm about to use it soon as I get done with this video to get me a little bit more workout in. Um, like I said, this is just a simple review I want to do. I want to thank you guys for actually paying attention to me um, and, you know, coming to my, you know, watching some of my videos. I thank you for the support out there, and I will keep trying my best to make even more and more videos. I know I've been slacking over time because some things been going on, trying to get some stuff adjusted in life, but I will try to bring you more videos. So I want to thank y'all. I want to say y'all be safe out there. Have a wonderful day before I slap you in the face. All right, then. Peace.